Let me paint a picture of what a smart city, a sentient city, looks like in the metaverse era. You are on your way to King Salman International Airport. At the airport, a three-dimensional traffic command platform tells you whether to take the metro, the underground, or a driverless taxi to a hotel. You choose a driverless taxi. It's rush hour, but the city's digital twin has already recognized that there is more traffic than normal around the airport, so it directs the taxi down a clearer route. In this case, it's a motorway that's normally two-way, but the digital twin has switched all lanes to flow in one direction, solving the jams before they even happen. You check into your hotel and call your family to check in on them and tell them you have arrived. Your grandchildren tell you they just spent the day in ancient Greece getting a math lesson from Pythagoras via their school's immersive learning technology. You meet some other organizations you are cooperating with. One is the nearby Souk, where the CTO's team have created virtual overlays for the fruit and vegetable merchants. So all you need to do is glance at one of the stalls and straight away you know what's in season, where the produce is from, and what you might make for dinner that evening. On the train, you talk to your local team about their logistics operation. They are designing highly adaptive distribution networks, warehouses, and sorting centers. And new hires to fill additional roles will be onboarded and trained quickly through virtual tours and simulated environments. Next, it is a local telco. You browse their digital twin of the country's telecoms infrastructure, discuss where to position new equipment to ensure maximum connectivity, and identify areas where upgrades or repositioning may be necessary. The number of use cases is simply huge, and we are only at the beginning of the journey. And remember, I have been painting a picture of just one city. Imagine the possibilities if these same technologies and services were rolled out to cities across the country, across continents, across the globe.